Okay, that then. Fair result in the end, you think? In the end, yeah. A bit shaky first half, although I think we were stronger, but it was the best. Yeah. First half was dire. Just some, just some crazy decisions, weren't there, throughout the yeah. game? Yeah. But, um, I think 1-1 one, was a fair, fair result at the end. Oh, take a point into the day there, do you reckon? Yeah, scrappy game. Um, terrible refereeing in the first half. You think, you know, the whole world's against you. We get a penalty, we take it. They then miss theirs. Fantastic. Yeah, take the point. We're two winnable games to come, hopefully. Can you make that then? Happy with the point at the end of the day? Um, I was, but I thought the referee was absolutely terrible. We could have got two, could have got the three points out of it. I thought we played really well first half. Second half they came at us, but I thought overall we deserved at least a point yeah, out of it. Yeah, take a point. Take a point here. They haven't lost, lost here since December. So take the one more. Take the one more. Absolutely. I mean, you know, Moutinho given, allegedly giving away a foul at the start. It was a penalty. It wasn't a penalty. Swatch the ball first and then the manga's down. Not a penalty. And then handball and, then, and not given and, yeah. and then outside the area and the penalty was given. It was, uh, I think he had a man to do it. But we got the point. We'll take that away and we'll go back to the next game and uh, do it again. The first half one was, was horrendous. You know, it was a beautiful slide in and tackle. Nobody from Bournemouth seemed to appeal for it whatsoever, and it just complete shock when he, yeah. when he blows for it. But they kept on going, and that's that's important in this side this season, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And they they stuck at it. It was a real grind for most of the game. You know, especially with Bournemouth being in front, they were able to um, keep in shape, press the space a lot. There wasn't a lot, but they just kept going. They kept grinding, and certainly the substitutions seemed to make a difference. Yeah. And I thought we were unlucky with some of the decisions. Yeah, referee had an absolute stinker, didn't he? Throughout, really. Well, he was, he was dire, wasn't he? I mean, let's face it, he didn't have a clue where, what he was doing. Uh, he even used to, I think, for second half. I couldn't see much in any of the penalties. So I just thought it was uh, an even game at the end of the day. Seventh to a tenth, easily. Easily. We ain't getting any lower than that. Stay where we are. I think we finished seventh for best, easily. So don't go, grab a worry about the teams around us. Just keep doing what we're doing. We'll, we'll be up there. And they go to, you go to Huddersfield and Cardiff, two, two games where you hopefully get maximum points. Absolutely. I mean, Huddersfield are as good as down. They don't seem to have had a revival with a new manager whatsoever. They don't seem any better whatsoever. Um, if anything, maybe slightly worse. And obviously, I think Cardiff, um, with the, uh, you know, on the back of that pasting um, last night, they, they can't be in a, in a good place now. They're, they're sort of that weird feel-good factor they, 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 they managed to gain from the, the tragic events. Um, it seems to have, have gone, and I think, yeah, you've got to look at that six points from those two games. But the most important thing is they've kept going, and, and, and they've got that point, and with, with games to come, Huddersfield and Cardiff, you've got to think they can kick on now. Well, the season for us, really, is all about, I think, it's still about staying up. Um, now we can push on to seventh. Shame what Watford won last night. I really want to get into Europe. We want a European tour.